Okay, we're now going to number. We're going to section seven. We are going to calculate our veg, uh, calculate vegetation indices. So, as I had said, you can on your on your YouTube channel you just go and search geospatial printer. You can also subscribe so as to get notifications when I add something new, and also okay. So, so as to get the the links to the code editor, you come to the playlist, and then you click view full playlist. So you can now get the the links to the code editor as you go along. So we are at number seven. So we are going to perform. We are going to get the vegetation indices from from satellite imagery. So we come here. Okay, vegetation indices. Yeah, here yeah, is okay. So, so we come there, okay. So we now it's just the same thing. We load our study area, and then we now use Sentinel two A to perform this task. Okay. So we display our row, our row Sentinel two A imagery. And filter it and then now calculation of NDVA so NDVA is, cal is a vegetation index and it can be calculated by subtracting band band 8 from band 4 so as you can see band 4 from so you can see you can see here what you are doing so the, the red band is band 4 so a red band and near near infrared band band 8 so we come here we come and we say we subtract the the near infrared band minus the red band all over all over the near infrared band all over the red band and then we rename it to NDVI okay so that is our NDVI the NWA now we get it from the green band and the near infrared band so you carry out the subtraction and divide and divide and divide again as you can see here so and then we display now the NDVI now the the NDWI so that is the the NWI is the normalized difference water index the NDVI is the normal difference vegetation index now we go to MSAVI MSAVI now to do it we'll we'll have to put an expression as you can see now, this is the expression to carry out MSAVI. So and also so MSAVI comes in two ways. You can get the fluent using the fluent and use on or either using an expression. So this is when we're using the expression. So we just get to we get to multiply and do some subtraction function there. So to get the MSAVI. And then to carry out now EVI, we come here, we now do a function to mask out our clouds and then this is the function and then we come here and input the function with an expression so this is the expression now and now we can we can get our evi so when i run this code i'll be able to see our study area and okay so this is the row in sentinel image the true color the ND, ndwa NDWA, NDVI, MSAVI, and the EVI. So, this is the raw sentinel image, the NDWA, and the and the. So this, is, so you can now see. So this is the okay now NDVI, MSAVI, NDWA, NDVI. So raw sentinel image, the true color image, the NDVI. So we first load the NDVI. So from the NDVI, you can see. So this is the NDVI. So it var it varies in values such that you can you can adjust you can adjust from zero to negative from zero to one. You can adjust depending on why how you want it to be displayed, and you can also change the colors here depending on how you want it to be displayed. Okay, and uh, now we go to. We now go to NDWI 
you can see in the WL now is displayed the msavi right there and finally the EVA as you can see okay okay that's okay